Well, in, in that same vein, Bernie Sanders brought a great deal of attention to a <laughs> Vermont designer <laughs> with a set of mittens that he wore. Um, and some of the memes, Bernie has places to be after this. He looks like he's headed to, and then they've gone and they've photoshopped Bernie in various locations in the same position he was sitting at um, on the Diaz there uh, at the Capitol yesterday. <laughs> the gloves. So those mitts. <laughs> and every, you know, everybody else had like the matching masks, right? Like the face coverings that were sort of, sort of jeweled and stuff. And Bernie got what? the the basic blue. Yeah, yeah. I saw I saw Bernie uh, a tweet that said, um, "The inauguration is on Bernie's to do list, but it ain't his whole day." <laughs> It looks like he's got his income tax return and his social security check, and he's headed to the bank. Um, so those mittens, by the way, were knit together by a woman named Jen Ellis. She is a teacher in Vermont, <laughs> and she made them for him two years ago. They are made of repurposed wool sweaters, and the lining is a felt made of recycled plastics. Leave it to our friends in Vermont. You know, they're all about, you know, repurposing, upcycling, all of those things that, that we talk about here, Jenny. <laughs> and those mittens now have their own Twitter account, and I bet you she's going to get orders for those mittens up there in it's Vermont. It's very on brand for Bernie. It really is. You, I mean, he could be showing up with something new. You, you just give, given his platforms and given uh, his conservation efforts, et cetera. So. Had he been elected president, <laughs> would he have worn the mittens to the inauguration? Well, I think so. Again, continuing on brand. Now, oh, continuing on with our discussion.